According to the World Health Organization, 16% of all deaths worldwide are from cancer, which is about 9 million per year. Chances are, you have probably known someone who's had cancer, which means that developing new therapies to treat it is essential. Well, today there's good news. There's been some rapid progress in the battle against cancer. A new CAR T-cell product called Chimera is used to treat acute lymphoblastic leukemia, a severe type of cancer that mainly affects children. Think of your immune system like a police force patrolling your body, getting rid of criminals, that is, abnormal cells. However, it is hard for these police cells to recognize cancer cells which are like criminals in disguise. Immunotherapy is essentially the use of clever detectives called chimeric antigen receptors or CAR cells that can recognize the cancer cells in disguise that your immune cells will then recognize and attack them. CAR T cell therapy uses immune cells called T cells and modifies them so that they can recognize and destroy a patient's specific cancer. Imagine CAR T cells like a keen detective that can recognize and then attack the cancer cell. First, blood is drawn from a patient and T cells are extracted and then the T cells are engineered to express a chimeric antigen receptor or CAR on the surface of the cell. The CAR is like a puzzle piece that's designed to attach perfectly to a specific antigen or marker that sits on the surface of the cancer cell. Billions of these reprogrammed CAR T cells are replicated and returned to the patient's body, modified so that they can recognize and attack cancer cells. Similar to the way a flashlight lets you see in the dark, the CAR T cells can now see their targets and they are instructed to bind, become active and then destroy cancer cells. In order to create these keen detectives or CAR T cells, the patient's T cells must undergo genetic modification. The instructions for these CAR T cells is delivered into donor cells with tools called lentiviral vectors. First, some blood is drawn from the patient and white blood cells, including T cells, are isolated. In the laboratory, the lentiviral vector are used to insert the functioning CAR T into the DNA of the collected T cells. The resulting CAR T cells can now recognize a specific marker that's produced on the surface of certain cells, including cancer cells. The CAR T cells are then multiplied and the new CAR T cells are sent back to the hospital where they're infused into the patient. CAR T cell therapy is revolutionary and very promising as they are very specific to the disease and it offers a great hope to the patients with aggressive cancers. One such example is Chimera which is used to treat ALL in children and young adults. 66% of patients who receive this treatment show no signs of cancer after 3 months and it has a 70% survival rate. These results are better than any other medicine used to treat this condition and highlights the potential of immunotherapy in treating not just ALL but cancer as a whole.